much, Mr. Speaker. I rise to recognize Lieutenant Commander Miguel Sanzisteban, who is receiving the U.S. Navy's nomination to be commander. Having fled Castro's regime at a young age, Miguel moved with his family to South Florida. Driven by his desire to serve our great country, Miguel joined the Navy in 1989. While stationed in Japan as a deck seaman, Miguel was one of the few selected to attend the Hospital Corpsman A School. He earned a master's degree in healthcare service administration at my alma mater, Florida International University. Miguel was commissioned in 2001 and completed his first duty assignment at the U.S. Naval Hospital in Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. He is currently an administrative officer for research and development at the U.S. Navy Bureau of Medicine and Surgery. Miguel has earned many accolades, including the Defense uh, Meritorious Service Medal, the NATO Medal, and the National Defense Service Medal several times. Miguel lives the Navy's core values of honor, courage, commitment. I join Lieutenant Commander Miguel Sancia Esteban's family and friends in congratulating him on this well-deserved nomination. We are so proud of you, Miguel. Felicidades.